And welcome back to the big show. Get ready to set sail this summer starting next month. The uh, Maritime and Seafood Industry Museum will be hosting a summer camp full of adventure. This is always a, a great event. Joining us uh, today is Elizabeth Alexander. How are you, Elizabeth? It's so good to see you. Well, thank you for having me. I've covered me. this. I've done stories on this before, and the kids have so much fun. What are the kind of the uh, age ranges of the kids? It's from six years old to 12 year old. Mm -hmm. We have two age groups, the, the bigs and the littles, but they're all big. Do you kind of put the little ones together and the big ones together? That is correct. Okay. Uh -huh. And people may have noticed, so we should right off the bat kind of explain yeah. why this boat is right here. This is one of the fun projects that they do that helps uh, encourage their interest in the Maritime and Seafood Industry Museum. This is our version of a replica of the beautiful Nydia that you can see from the museum mm -hmm. window when crossing the Ocean Springs Bridge. And they're going to be assembling, painting, and making it true to themselves. So uh, what other activities? I know they're going to have a day to get on the two schooners, mm -hmm. or one of the two schooners at least. And what other kind of activities are uh, on the menu? They a lot of coastal attractions, but fully educational. Um, of course, not only including touring the museum and doing an educational scavenger hunt with us, they're gonna be going on the sailfish and learning so much more information about shrimp. Yeah, I've been on the sailfish, that's great. It's a great It tour. still leaves Biloxi Harbor. It does. Small it craft does. harbor. Mm -hmm. And you go out and he drops the net and he pulls it up and everyone gets to see what, uh, what, what can't, comes out of the net. What you get, yep. And then we use the, what, our catch from there to have fishing contest at our Schooner Pier Complex. And we, of course, see the Lynn Meadows. We take the uh, youngers to the Lynn Meadows and the Mississippi Aquarium and go So for it. I think it lasts a week and you have six different sessions? Seven now. Seven We've added sessions. one more. Yes, sir. Okay. Mm -hmm. And people watching us right now, parents or even kids who are getting all excited uh, and saying, I want to be part of this, what do they do? Uh, you can actually register online. Right there on, on that website? website? Yes, okay. sir. You certainly can. Uh, and if you have any questions before you register, feel free to give me a call at the museum and I'll review some of the details and everything and work it out. But it's a, a registration is a very easy process and we still have openings for some of the later. Some of our weeks are getting close to filling up. So you want to, if you want to pick, pick now. But uh, we still have openings. And for finally, the just seven. a few seconds left. I mean, most of these kids, there might be some Louisiana, Alabama kids. I don't know. Yes. But, uh, you know, if they live on this coast, so mm -hmm. they should really appreciate and get to know everything about life on this coast, right? Absolutely. It's amazing how many don't, aren't familiar I with know. things and learn so much. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, Elizabeth, thanks for coming in and previewing the uh, summer camps over at the beautiful museum, uh, East Biloxi at the Point, and uh, you have a good summer, okay? All right. Thank you.